four-year plan, would the freezing of the tuition rates apply when she first signed up for the two-year program that would apply three years from now when she decides to go to the four-year plan? The answer is lamentably no. It is the rates for community college that are in place today. That's the contract that you signed for. Or the rates that are in place for the four years when you sign the contract. But if you sign it for community college two years, you can't say, well, when the rates were frozen for four years, can I get that rate? It would be for whatever is in, in, uh, in the stock for that year. And I hope that confused you plenty so that you have questions for me. I don't mean to be confusing. I want to answer your questions. And what Debbie proved to me is that you can call this number, this 800 number, and you get real live people. Very fast. And, and they answer, believe me, every question they've heard. In inglés y español. And the, the information here is in English and Spanish too. And don't sign anything until you're sure. But I'm telling you, I've been doing this a long time. There's never a problem. There's just never a problem. These folks want to work with you. This is a state of Florida program. This is not a private program where they're going to jerk you around. So you sign the contract for two years or you sign the contract for four years. Now you can't switch, but then the rate would be the college rate that's in, in effect when you, when you change your contract. So that's the reason that they, that's how they guarantee everybody in the program, you'll be fully paid for. That's why it ends at a certain time, so that they always know the money they have is enough to carry the program. That's why it opens at a certain date and it closes at a certain date. So no 